Welcome back everyone, my name is Aircode. Today is episode two of the Unity Realms SMP series. And boy, I've been super busy indeed. First thing is I have a different skin. And that is because last episode I told you I wanted like a Halloween themed scary crocodile. This one was crafted and created by Alex Craft AC. Now I might do a different skin every single episode. So if you guys wanna Halloweenify my skin, it's in description, feel free to treat it towards me. So I wanna start off with what I've been doing and what we are currently doing. So last episode was a very, very well unplanned episode because we, we came across skeleton horses. Sadly, all those horses are dead, even my one that was in the boat and I'll show you exactly where it is. Um, what happened is a skeleton got in the boat with my horse and it kept firing arrows at it, thinking that I was there and it died. So we don't got a skeleton horse anymore. Kind of sad. However, I do got quite a lot of iron ore. So we're going to get this smelted because the first thing I want to do is be fully prepared. I want to have full iron armor. I want to make sure I have full iron tools. And I want to slowly start to move away from Spawn Island. Now, there's a couple of other YouTubers online right now. We got Paddy. We got Dr. Jim Jim. Uh, Blue Jay was... Oh, okay. Nope. Nope. Bye. No. We're slowly going to be alone again. Um, guys, this series will be hosted every single Tuesday and Friday on my channel. So make sure you have the notifications on. Also, I asked you all last episode, do you like full episodes or do you like the episodes to be cut up? And as you can see here, it says 36% voted cut and 63% voted full. Now, don't worry if you guys voted cut, that's fine. I am going to try and bring the episodes as full as possible, but I'm also going to be cutting them up, just not as much as some of the other YouTubers, because I like I like for you guys to see all the nitty gritty stuff and what I've been doing. So the first thing we need to do, the first time we need to cut this video, is to get all this iron, because I kind of want to get outside this cave. Plus, we still need to get that iron as well. Right, looking good. So now I've got my iron helmet, which we got from the skeleton horseman. We've got the iron chest plate, we've got leggings, we've got iron booties. I kind of made an extra helmet by mistake, but that's fine because this is close to breaking. And we also have blast protection as well. So I plan to combine this, this, and this together once I have enough for an anvil. We've also got ourselves three bows as well, which I'm going to try and save the power just a little bit longer so we can finally get rid of our... Slowly start to get rid of our stone stuff. I made an extra pickaxe, so now we have two iron pickaxes because, well, stone just doesn't cut it out for me. I would rather risk it, make an iron pick, and hopefully find some more. So let's get out of here because I know what the other YouTubers have been doing is they've made a portal on this home island, which is, of course, another portal. You go through it and you come back through another portal. Oh, okay. He's not going to attack me, is he? I don't think he is. No. Spiders are so broken on this game. Um, so we go through one portal, we go through another one, and then we come out apparently by a dark oak forest, which to me is good because I love dark oak. Now I haven't decided what kind of house I'm going to build. Wait, is that iron over there? Oh, there's a piece of iron. Oh, we can't miss this because I've now got one them and one, one ore. Okay, we need one more. We can make ourselves an axe. Then we can fully ditch using stone because... Stone, like I said, just doesn't cut it. Now, I had a massive problem trying to find this cave system. I kept getting lost. I, I literally dug everywhere. Now, I found it. I don't think we need to be here. It's always it's always nighttime. It's always nighttime. And I also see some of the other YouTubers have been using my trees and replanting them. But there's the portal there. There's the creeper over there. I think we can make this. I think we should be okay. Oh, yeah. I need to show you guys my horse. Um, so, this is sad. Well, I don't, I don't got a horse anymore. So, th that boat over there. It had my skeleton horse in it, I was in it, I got out, did a little bit of fishing over there, and then came back and this skeleton was inside of it. Now, one or two shots of the arrow, it killed the horse, and it was kind of game over for me. So, we don't got any more skeleton friends. Get out of here, zombie. So, we don't got any friends anymore. That's, it's sad, but that happens. Has anybody been inside this cave? I would imagine so, right? Surely they, they, did, they didn't fully take everything in here. All right, well, how much coal have I got? I got 27. Ah, we're okay. I've also got some torches as well. I just want to... I just want to leave this island. I want to go to new places, but I'm bringing this just in case when we get through over there, we don't find ourselves any sugar cane. So let's go straight into the portal and let's see where this takes us. First thing I hear when we're inside of here is ghasts. Oh, that does not sound very pleasant at all. But as you can see, oh, there's a ghast. I don't want to be doing, it's too early on for me to be in here. Let's go. As we can see, there's another portal here. So I'm gonna, oh. 
There's a ghast. Guys, I gotta be really careful here. I got, I do got arrows, but I kind of don't want to use these arrows. I kind of want to save them for an emergency for when I do come back. There's lava there, though. This, I feel like this is total wipeout. Go, 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 go. Okay, I think we're safe. We're safe. What does this say? This says, roof forest slash village spawn slash witch. <gasps> ah. <gasps> okay, well, I guess, I guess we're going this way. I see the light at the end of the tunnel. Okay, these guys have been very, very busy inside of here. Because remember, if I'm correct here, guys, one step in the nether is like seven or eight in the overworld, which is why you can travel so far so quick. Please be a dark oak forest. I'm hoping I've read the signs right. This is... Oh, it does got a village. It's also got a snow biome, which is also very pleasant as well. I, did that spider come back with... Come through with us? All right, well, let's... Let's go and f oh, this is a good place. A village is always a good place to to stay. And there's some, did somebody die over here? I feel like somebody's, this is someone's stuff. Oh, it's a baby zombie. Okay, let's give it a view. Ah, okay, you're dead. There's a spidey. Somebody's been, someone's around here. Someone's got, some of the other YouTubers have got to be around here. There's so many mobs and monsters. There's a, a zombie villager as well. We should probably start. Hold on, oh, okay, I thought I ran out of food then. We're okay for food for now. There's bunny rabbits, okay. And this is the village. It says there's a dark oak forest though. I don't see, I don't see it. And they've obviously taken all the stuff from here as well. Is there any, any of the villagers alive though? Cause I would really like to, wait. Oh no, they left. It's just me and Patty. I feel like, I don't see the dark oak forest. There's, oh, I want to stay away from him. This could be this could be a, a good place and a really really bad place. And they're chasing the villager. He's like, save me! No, obviously these used to be a part of the village. Now they belong to death. Okay, well we need to get out of here. I don't want to stay around here because the longer you're around here, the more zombies are gonna spawn. Uh, this seems like a very very different place. I kind of oh, okay. There's everything's here. There's there's so much stuff. I'm doing the traveling at the wrong time here. Let's do a little bit of wandering and see what we can find. I don't mind adventuring for a little bit. Probably not the best thing to do at nighttime though. Ah, we found it. Okay, this seems like a really good place. It's not a really good time to be doing this. I've just been being chased by a creeper skeleton, now a zombie and a spider. And there's also a winch over there as well. However, I like this spawn. I think this has turned out pretty well. There's another baby zombie. There's so many, it's not even a baby zombie, it's a normal zombie. There's so many monsters in here, isn't it? It's, it's, it's nearly daytime. Okay, let's wait out daytime and then we can do more exploring. There are so many monsters. What a perfect way to start a Minecraft day. Simply watching the sunrise. It looks so good on this version. There's a couple of zombies up there, so they should die. There's also a scary ghoulie over there, which I kind of want to mess with. So the dark oak forest is to the right. I didn't notice it. You know why? Because I, I was, I forgot about the trees. In this version of, I can't, wait, he's got an enchanted bow. Is that enchanted? Is it enchant? Oh, it is. <gasps> Oh, did he drop it? That's the question. No, he didn't drop it. But yeah, I forgot in this version that the trees are affected by like snowy biomes, which which looks actually amazing. It looks so impressive. I would really love to know where the other YouTubers are living. Now, I do like some dark oak and I actually, oh, we're pretty okay for wood at the moment. So I want to run through this. I just want to see if anyone's building around here. And I'm definitely going to bring this because... I know from past experience, I love to use red, okay? And this means infinite red dye. All I gotta find now is a lot of bones, but this is, oh wow, this is more like it. I actually really like this. This could be the place that we live. Instead of me, you know what? Instead of me going on a massive adventure, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna stack up around about 32 blocks high, and we're gonna see what's around here. It saves me doing constant traveling because I'm, I don't really got lots and lots of food. I don't got a constant food source currently. So this could be, this could be good for us. Let's have a quick look. Hmm. All right. Well, it, it just looks, you know what? There's water over there. So I might take a little bit of a trip around there just to have a quick look. In fact, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Let's go this way. So after a little bit more exploring, I've actually found a small plains area. 
So what I did is I went to the water like I explained and I followed it round. Now this is a really good place because we're in between a couple of biomes now. We've got the dark oak forest, we've got plains, we've got a sand biome over there. This could be the place that I live. I, I think this would be a really good start. Now I don't really know where all the other YouTubers are going to be living. I think this would be a great place for us to make some kind of kingdom around here. But then again, everybody has their own taste. Like I love, I love plains biomes. They're filled with animals. You get, oh, there's a village. Okay, we gotta take this village. They're filled with animals. It's relatively flat. Now, if nobody's been here, we could we could actually find ourselves some goodies to start off with. But I think this could be the, the place that we stay. So I'm gonna let you guys decide. Do we set home here? And then in the next episode, begin to do some building of houses. Because I think that would be a good thing to do. Start to get a home built. Start to, to live around here. I love living next to villages. The reason why is because they always trade the goodies. They always... Please tell me no one's been here. <gasps> Nobody's been here. Yes. All right. This, could def this is definitely going to be our home. Wait, wait, bookcases are still here. Two bookcases are still here. Okay, we can make we can make enchantment areas. We can make so much awesome things. Right, guys, I think I think this is where we're gonna settle. I think this is where we're gonna stay. So for the meantime, I'm gonna quickly make myself a chest. I think it's a good thing to do. Let's get this down. Let's make ourselves a couple of pieces of this. Let's make let's just quickly by the way, I've still got this, so let's go and plant these down over here. Because I know we're going to use these eventually. But I feel like we could find a lot of goodies around here. Nobody's been here. So this would be a really, really good place to go. And I, also, I can find my way back. It's literally straight through there. It's it's like around about a five-minute walk. It's not that far. Forget everything that I told you about staying in that village. It turns out that I made a little bit of a mistake when we got to this point. So it turns out all the YouTubers are living inside of here. So we came from that way. We came here. And I was really convinced that they were living down there. Turns out that's just another portal to try and find a roofed forest. So they're all living inside of here. Now not to worry because I have brought all my goodies, including the bookcases. We still know where that village is, which is a massive bonus. But this makes a lot more sense. This makes so much more sense. Thank you, Paddy. Paddy was the one who helped me out because I got really confused. I was like, wait, I've explored. I didn't find anything, didn't see anyone. And that is because this is going to be our new kingdom. I really like this. Now, I'm going to do a little bit of uh, exploring. I kind of don't want to ruin too many builds. It looks like... Who's online? Oh, it's Jim. Jim's over there. All right. I, I don't want to spoil too much or ruin too much because I don't know what's new, what they want to share, and what they don't want to share. But hopefully everything that... There's so many cows in here. <laughs> there's so many cows. Um, obviously, they don't. I don't want to spoil their builds. But by me judging if they built things, then more than likely... Ah, oh, there's a creeper. They more than likely put them in videos. Now, I absolutely love this. This is... I don't know who built this. Let's go and figure this out. This is a ship and it looks... I, I, it's Oh, it's inhabited by, by a zombie as well. I don't know if they made it look like a, like it's just been docked and left there to rot. Or they kind of want to make this their home or something like that. Because it's covered in vines. Kind of gives it that, that like kind of old style feeling. But this seems like a, a, a greater place to live. It just seems so much better. Prettier. And they, they've been really busy with the tree farms and all the tree stuff going on. So my current aim right now is to try and find a place. That, is, it a, is it a home? I kind of feel like it is a home. This is absolutely amazing. I love this so much. This must have took so long to build. Wow. I'm so impressed. I'm so, so impressed. This is the also Wait, wait, wait. Daphne's place. Wait, this is just your home, Daphne? Or is it the boat yours? I'm so glad to be in a series with people who can actually build because I can't build, but when they build their things and like I look back, I, I, I see it as all inspiration. They kind of they kind of push me along to build a lot better. So I guess we better go and do a little bit of exploring and see what we can find. Okay then. So it looks like we found a little bit of an animal gathering. <laughs> there are so many horses here. And there's so many in the water as well. Well, now I've seen it all. Horses have their own parties. Oh, we found Dr. Jim Jim. He's, I'm guessing this is a boot. I love this. I love his home. Wait, what does it say? Smelly boot. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> I love your house. You guys are so amazing at building. I love this. This is so cool. Standing on the balcony of a boot. Oh, that's a, that's a skeleton over there. I gotta definitely step up my game. 
These people are so good at building. Dr. Jim Jim, I love your house. I absolutely love it. All right, I don't want to spoil too much because of course this is his build. Hopefully by the time you see my video, you've already seen his. That's the only problem. Nobody has a specific time of uploading. Well, they do, but I don't really know everybody's schedule. They probably don't all know mine. I'm just, I'm just seeing this. Is this Jojo? This looks like it could be the work of Jojo. Jojo does love a good pixel art. I think he built it. He built a dinosaur last time. And actually, Dallas has Slime Island near spawn. I think I found a much better Slime Island for him. Look at the whole entire place that he could live in. All right, guys, we're still traveling. Probably the worst thing to do at nighttime, but we might find ourselves somewhere, somewhere good to live. It really wasn't that difficult. Nobody's claimed this land. And like I explained earlier on, I love to live in a plains area. Again, this is a good variation of biomes. We've got a forest behind us with plenty of trees. We live in a relatively flat plains biome. We've got a birch forest over there. We've got a swamp over there. I think this is going to be a very, very nice place to live. And I also think a lot of the YouTubers might also call this as like the center of town because because it's flat, they can build here. Uh, I've also got a lot of materials that I need to pick up. So the first thing, now we can finally set home. This, this can be our place. I, I'm going to get a chest down. Please don't be attacked by any mobs. In fact, let's just try and be a little bit a little bit more careful here. Because I will place down a lot of torches eventually. But there's a creeper over there. I don't want him to sneak behind me. So we'll get a couple of torches down. We'll get my chest down. We'll get some stuff down. And I can also get some signs down and claim this land. Unless somebody's claimed that over there. Let's have a quick look. Get away, creeper. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. Okay, well, you know what? Do whatever you want to do. You ruin all the fun. Ruin all the fun. Has anybody claimed this area? Because somebody could be living within this mountain. It looks like that is a no. That is a negative. It looks like they're just claiming that place. We're not claiming it. They're just using. Oh wait, I gotta get. Look at all the stuff. There's so much food everywhere. Did I break my bow? I didn't break my bow. I'm gonna kill you though. There's so many, so many monsters around here. It's so annoying. They're just so annoying. Right? Where did I put my crafting table? I don't even think I put one down, did I? Okay. So crafting table. Let's get both of these down because of course I'm gonna need food. And let's make myself another chest. So we can make a double one. I can hear spiders, of course. I've killed that many mobs that I'm honestly, guys, I feel like swords. I'm gonna go through so many swords. Chests. Alright, let's put this sign down. Land claimed by Echo. With a smiley face. Now, if somebody else is living here, of course I'll have to move, but I don't want to. I've moved enough. I want to have a place that I can call home. I like this area. This is going to be a fun place to live. All right, let's sort out my inventory a little bit. Oh, seriously. Stop it. Let's put our stuff in here. So I'm going to put... In fact, I didn't even have my armor on. That would be a good thing to do. We'll go with the unbreaking one for now. The rest of the stuff in here. Those things I don't need to be carrying. I'm going to smelt some more food as well. Because, again, I'd rather stack up on food because we'll need it. This can go in here as well. And then food. And food. And I think we're going to draw today's episode to a, to a close, guys. Because going forward from here, you're going to see more productive episodes. Now that i found a place that I want to live in, I can now get some work done. I can knock down some trees. I can build some houses. I can build some place to live. I, I feel like this is going to be a much better season for me compared to season one. The reason why is because I kind of had my work cut out with you guys wanting me to build using blue concrete. I might use concrete, but I think this time it's going to be a concrete of choice from me and on my realm specifically I built with white concrete which worked very very well so that could be something that we could use so a couple more animal kills let's just get rid of you and I'm sorry chicken but you too because I'll take your feathers everything can be re recycled in Minecraft so remember that last thing eight torches to place down guys I've been Echo have a great day stay beautiful and of course I'll catch you next time bye